and welcome to Adobe Acrobat Tips and Tricks from the authors of The Ultimate Guide to Adobe Acrobat DC, now in its second edition. I'm Dan Siegel, and I'm a co-author of the book with Pam Myers. If you want more information about how to public purchase the book, go to bit.ly forward slash acrobat book two to purchase the book. You can also contact us at these email addresses or via our website to purchase Adobe Acrobat for on-site or remote training and for all your technology and workflow needs. Our topic today is real simple. Why the won't Adobe Acrobat OCR this page? This is a common problem. You have had OCR done on a document. You want to then copy and paste from a document. You may want to move an image. You may want to do something like that. And no matter what you do, Acrobat leaves the page as an image. Here is the example, this page. And as we go into the Acrobat uh, regular interface, what you saw before was full screen, control L, you can see that this is a document that is not, you know, you can't, it's not OCR, you can't copy text, you can't do anything with the document on this, and this is the one page of the document that constantly would not allow us to do anything. So what you want to do to get this page OCR'd is to go into your tools and click Edit. Now when you click Edit, you can see up here on the upper left of the document is that little image which tells you, and you know, if I try to move or, or capture text, nothing happens. It just won't work. And this is after OCRing and OCRing the document multiple times. And you just want to scream because you want to copy some of the text. There's an easy solution, but it's not the most intuitive because you would think that you would just go to the OCR, the read and scan settings, but you don't. When you have a document like this and a page like this that doesn't want to cooperate, you want to go back and change the settings. And once you change these settings, you shouldn't have this problem ever again. So here we are on the edit screen. And I'm going to go down here to Scanned Documents. And I'm going to click on the Settings. And the settings are going to ask me, do I want to recognize text in English or whatever language? But also to make all the pages edible. And when you click on the little info screen, it says it will convert all pages of a scanned document to editable text and images in one go. So, all I did was click scan doc, go to scan documents and click on settings and made this check here and OK. Now, what it tells me is that all the unsaved changes will be lost, but I want to continue. Yes. And now it is performing page and image recognition and suddenly here it is. I can copy text. I can move it around. You'll also see that for scan documents it now says recognize text here. If you don't want it to automatically do that in the future, you can uncheck it. That's up to you. You get the same warning. Once I save this document though, if I uncheck it, yes, any changes will have been lost and there it is. As soon as I click Recognize Text, there it is. It's OCR'd. I leave it on. I save it. I can copy and paste. It's that simple. You have to go down here, change the settings to make all the pages edible, and recognize text, and you're done. This has been Adobe Acrobat Tips and Tricks from the authors of The Ultimate Guide to Adobe Acrobat DC. I'm Dan Sigel and from my co-author Pam Myers. Thanks for watching this video. You can go to uh, this page uh, to visit us and to purchase the book, get more information, etc. This is how you can find us. We hope this video has been helpful and informative. Thanks again for watching.